Hello, my name is Charlie Walker. I'm one of the founders of Red Earth Energy Storage, which has been established since 2013. The primary goal of Red Earth Energy Storage is to enable uh, users in Australia, whether they're businesses or residences, to profit from their own solar and to be self-sufficient in electricity. Red Earth's private power plant, or PPP, is hardware and software which is designed to monetize your homemade solar electricity and in some cases it can make you a passive income on a daily basis just depending on how much you use and how much you make of electricity. The PPP suits uh, anything from a shed up to a mining site and everything in between and really gives customers and users of electricity control over their bills and over their power generation. So we often get asked what the difference is between the RPPP and a VPP or a virtual power plant and simply put the VPP is designed for a different purpose and the benefits of a VPP don't go to the end user and there is money to be made from your own solar. The benefits of the PPP enable the benefit to be with our customers and end users and as I say potentially make a passive income on a daily basis depending on your circumstances. So the objective of a PPP is to um, be fit for the future so ready for electric vehicles. Um, it's scalable from the hardware perspective so it's, it's small uh, sheds all the way up to mining sites and in some circumstances other than wiping out your electricity bills um, it can be used to generate passive income and to give an example um, one customer's made uh, up to two thousand dollars a day clearly that's not from a resident's point of view resident's point of view but um, you know typical residents can expect between naught and ten dollars a day over and above their electricity saving the point being that it's quite flexible the software goes over large and small businesses and the system can be upgraded or downgraded depending on people's circumstances. So among other things, uh, the private power plant is able to trade spare energy out of your home. Now it will depend on how much electricity your home uses at certain times, but as we know the sun shines during the day and that's when electricity is cheap. We use electricity all around the 24 hours, so the idea is it accumulates electricity during the day when it's cheap and depending on your circumstances can sell it when it's expensive at dinner time, for example. Now that will depend how you use your electricity, who's in the home, who's in the business, how the patterns are of electricity being used, but generally saying that is entirely possible depending on the size of the system and your particular circumstances. Uh, so making a passive income from the PPP is entirely possible. It does depend on your circumstances, including when you use electricity and um, how, how the business or the residence is set up. Okay, so what does it mean from an end user's perspective or whether it's you're talking about a shed or a mining site? Um, the setup is a bunch of hardware, which is boring and it's around the back of the home or on the site, on the mining site. Um, but there's a software platform that interacts with that. Now that can either be on an automatic basis or a proactive basis, depending on the customer. And I just got the app here. And this is an um, interactive map that shows you uh, what's happening on a daily basis. It gives you control. So control would be charging your battery up or um, setting it to trade or interacting with your electric vehicle if that's what customers want. Most customers just want it to do its thing. And so we have the algorithm automatically uh, caters for that and basically optimizes the value of electricity um, for you so you don't have to worry about it. Other than looking at the app, which is useful for customers to interact with on a daily basis, it's supported here by our platform technology, which means we have a team of people in Australia, in Brisbane, who can access your system and make sure that it's reliable for a long, long term. It's warranted for 10 years, but we expect to be longer than that. And who can also interact with you if you want to upgrade or you're moving. Um, and the, the point is others don't offer that. And this proactive control and relationship that we're generating with end users works both ways. It enables us to make sure the system's continually functional and it gives you peace of mind to know that the, consist the system's continually functional. So thanks for listening. Um, it's enjoyable to tell you about the PPP. It's been developed over uh, more than a decade and has really been designed to help the end users rather than the power companies and to give you autonomy over what happens at your home or your business and ideally make you a little bit of money. Hi, I'm Sri and I'm an electrical engineer here at Red Earth and I work on developing the private power plant. Um, so the private power plant are modules and features that add value to your solar battery system and the way that you can interact with them is through our Red Earth EMU app. 
as well as a web browser version of the app that you can find at reddit.cloud.